Hey everyone, how's it going? I am Zerikon and I am back once again. Today we're going to talk about Sony because they've managed to mess up once again regarding PC releases. And this time it's a completely different reason, uh, so let's talk about this. Sony released Days Gone and it's performed well. I mean, it's the performance is a way better than what was being done for Horizon Zero Dawn, so... That was a positive, and so far it's been getting, you know, pretty good reviews on Steam. However, there's something that's been found that is very, very bad, and that is their data collection policy, which is enabling the game to uh, record keystroke data, so any keystrokes that you make, anything you're typing, and I think it's, it's, it's like goes through your files, any of that is being recorded and sent to Sony and that's being done whenever the game's open whenever it's running even if you're like doing stuff in the background uh it'll still be recording you even then and the reason is to is uh to combat piracy well not piracy but cheating which is really weird considering the fact that you know this is a single player game and there aren't any online or multiplayer elements so i don't know why they're being that aggressive, but they are recording your data. They're recording everything you're doing and sending it to Sony. And that is a real big problem right there. Uh, there's absolutely no reason why they should be doing this. And if it was, say, a online multiplayer game, uh, like, say, it was, like, PUBG, Fortnite, uh, Valorant, uh, Apex Legends, one of those games, then... It would make sense. I, I could understand that. But this is a single player game with no multiplayer aspect. So there's no reason for you to be recording keystroke data. And the crazy thing is that Sony is once again messing up their launch. And it's a completely different reason. Don't get me wrong. And you are able to bypass this by blocking it via your firewall. But how can you have one problem for a, re a release and then have another problem for another release? Sony is releasing more games. They've said they're... Uh, bring a whole slate of games over so they really need to they really need to iron out all these problems right now they need to say they need to sit down and say okay we need to stop like doing this we need to stop doing this before we start bringing out major releases and bring out other games because this is completely unacceptable and all they're really going to be doing is encouraging really ironically they're going to be encouraging piracy because they are making these games uh either messed up or they're invading the privacy of gamers. Now, I've been reading the EU LAs more closely uh, than I've used to, just because I want to know what I'm getting myself into when I'm downloading these games and starting them. And this is exactly why I went, I, I've started doing that more now. And I would suggest that you might want to do that as well. But again, as, as always, I, I guess I should say, don't buy a game at launch. But that's going to do it for today. I will see you all next time. Thank you for taking time to watch this video. I just wanted to let you all know about this ridiculous situation that's occurred. So until next time, everyone, I am Zerikon signing off. Have a good one.